Call the Midwife stars Helen George and Jack Ashton reveal name of baby daughter. The TV pair recently welcomed their first baby a girl called Ren. Helen is famous for playing nurse Trixie Franklin in the show and delivering heaps of children over the years. But when she went into labor in hospital she got no special treatment as her real-life midwife didn't recognize her. Her partner Jack, who plays vicar Tom Harewood, revealed, we had a midwife and she was wonderful. They all were. We have nothing but praise for the NHS. But they didn't know who we were until after. They said, we didn't know you were famous. When Ren was so young, having no sleep changed my acting Jack Ashton but that was great. We were treated just like everybody else. However, the sleepless nights took a toll once the baby was born and Jack was still needed on set. He laughed, when Ren was so young, having no sleep changed my acting. It's a lot easier to act less emotion when you haven't slept for 48 hours. And the only tip about babies I learned by being on the show was don't drop them. Helen, who was pregnant while filming, said it was strange being surrounded by babies on set when she was about to give birth herself. She added, I definitely felt more emotional about it. I love babies. The Christmas Day episode on BBC One at 7.40pm will have a very festive feel as one plotline loosely mirrors the nativity story with an unmarried couple living in a caravan awaiting the birth of a baby. Writer Heidi said. I always try to reflect the Christmas story at some point. And some of the characters from Nonnitus House even take part in a panto with handy Manfred Buckle, Cliff Parisi, as the dame and Helen as the front end of a cow. Dash. Call the censors the new series in the new year will be full of F-words but don't worry. Gordon Ramsay hasn't taken over. Writer Heidi Thomas said, in series 7 we are still feminist, we are still furious, we still have fun and we are still fertile. But I think the emergent theme is family. Times are changing in 1963 and you will see families reorientating themselves. What happens when the father dies, what happens when a mother becomes disabled? All these things we put into the mix. But the biggest star of the show continues to be the uterus. Dash. Its snow joke truckloads of fake snow were used in the Christmas special to recreate the big freeze. The snap hit the country on Boxing Day 1962 and lasted three months and proved the coldest winter for 300 years. Stephen McGann, who plays Dr. Patrick Turner, Revealed he was actually born during the big freeze. He said, I was born at night and took ages to come so my mum called the midwife. 
She came out on her bicycle but was in a foul mood as she'd just gone to bed and had taken a sleeping pill. I always laugh because now I'm playing a doctor with all these nice midwives and I had the really rotten one smacking my backside in a bad temper. Call a truce. Writer Heidi Thomas says the Christmas TV schedules should not be about fighting over ratings. She said, we should be like the soldiers in World War I and call a truce in the trenches. Christmas TV should be about people coming together. <laughs>